Afternoon, Pep. Hope you're well. Uh, Steve Cooper has said Manchester City at the Etihad is the hardest game in world football. What do you make of those comments and are you delighted that you've created that kind of environment here? Oh, we'll see tomorrow. Uh, it's a compliment. Thank you so much to Steve. But uh, they were able to do an incredible game in Stamford Bridge and until the end they fought a lot against Arsenal away and against against United with 0-2 after a few minutes and uh, last season we could not win there that we make an incredible good game we missed a lot of chances we could not do it so yeah we cannot deny the last year and this year again so at home we feel feel good but tomorrow at 3pm we have to prove again you mentioned some of the achievements for, for Steve. What have you made of what he's done, getting them promoted and reshaping that at Nottingham Forest? Well, the most important thing is the fact that when he took over the team last season, uh, no, two seasons ago in the Championship, was not good Nottingham Forest. And after making a camera run, was promoted. And they struggled all season, but at the end they finished well with a lot of signs and settled this. is not easy, and they did it, and this season started really well. So make much much points much more points than that season and at the end it's a physicality team well organized the pace in the transitions are really really high so just be careful uh, in terms of of course we are optimistic to do what you have to do with uh, our people and try to to make the six win in a row You've highlighted the, the number of injuries. How important is this period going to be for some of your young players to potentially step up and, and shine during this sort of busy period whilst you've got those key players out? But I said many, many times in many years when a young players in the squad training with us and ready to play is because we trust a lot of them, we rely on them and they can do it whatever we want. A part of that, so we need the injured players back because there are a lot of games and we cannot play the same players for a long, long time and it's important to have enough. But Jack is, is coming back in terms of yes, the train trained well and maybe will be for some minutes maybe ready. And Koba is Matteo is uh, almost yeah in the last part of the of the recovery to coming back but now we lost Bernardo for a few days and and John and Kevin and you know they are still out. I bet. Um on Bernardo, then, what is, what is the diagnosis? How long do you expect him to be out? No, for? I have a little injury. It's not nothing in much. The clinical development is good, but I know one week, ten days, 15, one week, two weeks will be will be out. Last season, you, you seem to be kind of okay on the injury front. I know you like to work with a smaller squad. This season, at the start, it's kind of all happened at, at once. Is is there a reason behind that? Yeah, a lot of games. It is just overloaded games, is it? Absolutely. With less games, less injuries. A lot of games, a lot of seasons in a row with a not much rest. Uh, this is just that. So we demand to the players a lot, a lot of effort, a lot of games, and sometimes they cannot sustain it. And sometimes it's unlucky. So the Jack was out in Sheffield, was an incredible knock, his knee, and that's football, it happened. But normally the muscular issues is a lot of games. Um, fine, I know everyone talks about him at the minute. Rodri, is there a more complete player in world football right now than, than your own midfielder? He's an exceptional holding midfielder. No doubt about that. He's exceptional. As complete or complete, I don't know. Hey, Pep, good afternoon. Um, if you win tomorrow, that's 18 points from six games, which is better than the start last season in the Premier League. How, how delighted and how surprised have you been at the way your players have started this season, bearing in mind we, we thought maybe there might be a, an after-effect of winning the treble? When we arrived here seven, eight years ago, we make six to six. Yeah, we finished third or fourth, I don't remember. So it's just the beginning. So it's, it's important to, you know, to get points and because the competition is hard, the opponents... Some of them miss not don't miss much much points, but it's just at the beginning. So, but it's important to get points, definitely. 
having had the experience of winning the treble, is, is this a, an easier squad to manage now this season? Do they, they know what they have to do almost? All the squads were so easy to handle it. The squads were really, really good. All of them. And the teams were really good. And the success that now belongs to the success of the players of the past because we learn of them, we, we improve what we have done in the past. So it's, it's a consequence. So I'm not going to say this team is better than the previous one and the previous one is better than the previous, previous, previous one. So every, every, every team, the club, give it to me, to us, staff, backroom, manager staff, it's always have been really good. And how impressed have you been with Alvarez? Because he, he seemed to be in and out last season. This season you've played him in all five games so far. He's waited very patiently for his chance and seems to be taking it with both hands. Always have a, be a good behaviour. Winning, uh, playing, no playing. Being world champion or being world champion always has behaviour. On and off the pitch was the same. Of course, the perfect doses of, of I would say... The perfect doses, I would say, of, of disappointment for didn't play, but you behave like that, always you had the opportunity. Of course, last season we had uh, Ilkay and, and Kevin, sharp and a good moment. And and right now, for the circumstances, for the injuries, or for whatever reason, had these minutes, and he gave us a lot, a lot of good things to us, and and yeah, and that's why he's playing. But he has to continue many games. There will be games I will not play and be ready for that. And with a lot of games, hopefully the players come back from the injuries and everyone they have to battle and fight for the best position and, and play the games.